main part of where Arwen hit and what you see through there just before Arwen you wouldn't have seen through there it's just a, a mass of trees and all that's left of these large trees which aren't especially happy and they're quite exposed to the wind so a strong gale will probably start bringing some more of those down of course Arwen only devastated this area because it blew from a direction um, that isn't normal. These trees had all buttressed themselves for the prevailing winds and this one came from the, the opposite direction mm. and just knocked them over. Um, and as it opened up a space so it allowed more wind to come in and that just domino affected all the way through. Mm. Not a bad thing though because it saved us about 10 years of slowly chipping away and allowing re regeneration to occur. Mm -hmm. And that was pretty much all in one night wasn't it? Uh, yeah, over two nights. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. We'd removed two trees from the road the day before mm -hmm. <laughs> and then we came back thinking oh we just have to take another couple of trees up and there was about 50 trees across the road and uh, this what, five acres of uh, Ex woodland. Yeah. Right, there we go.